I, I'm not quite at the uh, ball is life level. I'm <laughs> right below that. I'm at the right ball is that. hobby level. Ball yeah. is hobby level. What's up, guys? Mike Bo here with another episode of ICTV's online dating challenge series, brought to you by East Meet East, the premier dating site for Asian singles. Yeah. We are here again with our teams, Jeffrey and Harry, Angie and Adrian, and June and Sam. Now, obviously, your coaches have impeccable style, so today we are going to do the makeover challenge. In this challenge, your coaches are going to talk to you guys and develop your dating profiles, as well as give you a brand spanking new outfit. All right, let's get to know our contestants and start the makeover challenge. Let's go. All right, so Sam, mm -hmm. we have to make, first of all, we have to make yourself a bio. Yeah, for, we, we have to do that, yeah. Exactly, for your profile and I just want to get to know you. Start off with food. What's your favorite food meal? Uh, well, I mean, I I like brunch. Brunch. Yes, I guess that's my favorite meal. That's of that, the day. That, or... That's really vague. Do you do any sports? I remember from the photo shoot, you had a basketball and yeah, like, I, boxing gloves and everything. Right? I play a lot of ball. Okay, okay, this is a shot in the dark. But like, what if like it rhymed? Like, what if like the bio rhymed? Like it's just like one. Rhymed. It's just like one poem. Yeah, because I, think that would I, be I saw really something good. about yeah, I saw something about like online dating bios, and it's like you have to be like witty, catchy, you know, get yeah. girls' attention. So All right, I think could we come up with something like that. Say something. Sam, I am. I'm putting on the, Sam, okay, Sam, I am. That's, okay, I, I could work with <laughs> Sam, I am. No, I don't like green eggs and ham, but I do like long brunch on the beach because, you know, I like brunch. <laughs> <laughs> on the beach? <laughs> now, talking about your fashion and style, I just want to know what kind of, like, what would you dress on, like, a casual day or, like, out to dinner and stuff like that? What's your normal style? Uh, well, for my casual, like, style, I kind of like you know, like semi-formal. Mm -hmm. I, I like uh, for button your ups. For your casual, you like semi-formal? Yeah, like oh, okay. I like I like button-ups or collared shirts. I always try to wear like a collared shirt, you know, it makes oh, me feel awesome. more like an adult. All right, okay, I think I got enough information. Cool, okay. Right. Sounds yeah. good. Sounds great. Okay, so Adrian, um, I wanna help you out the best I can. Yeah. So, um, can you just tell me more about your hobbies and interests? Yeah, I like going to shows, I go to a bunch of concerts and music festivals, I like traveling the world, going to different places, eating lots of food. What's your um, perfect idea of the perfect date? Um, maybe just going to the zoo or just something that's a surprise, something that's different. I don't want to go to the movies because I can't even talk to them. Right. And I just, but what, I, what if like the guy um, like picks out a scary movie because he wants you to <laughs> like... <sighs> Can you tell me more about your style? Yeah, I like anything that's bold, has a lot of patterns. I like wearing dresses for dates and... Okay. Dresses so yep. you can eat a lot, right? And they won't see. Yeah, I can't okay. have high waisted pants. Cause oh, yeah, the bulge, like much. what I have right now, but yeah. thank goodness no. this is free. <laughs> okay, Harry, it's nice to finally have time to talk to you and yep. get to know you. Likewise. So now we gotta work on our bio, mm -hmm. on your bio, and I gotta get to know you a little better so that we get the key elements mm -hmm. into those few lines. Are you a school guy or are you more an artsy guy? I'd say a little bit of both. You know, I like to focus on my studies a lot, but at the same time, I like to, you know, do what I want to do. Sophisticated. I like that. Okay, let's keep that. Do you have any hobbies? Hobbies? Yes. I like to draw, cook, and occasionally go rock climbing or hiking. You like to draw, cook, and hiking? Mm -hmm. Let's keep that. All right, in terms of fashion, are uh -huh. you more of a colorful guy? Do you keep it simple, casual? I like to keep it simple. I don't like something that would like draw too much attention towards okay. me. I okay, like clean aesthetic. Got it, okay, you know, so simple. formal, casual. I think I got what I need. All right, we're at the mall. Contestants, you stay with me. Coaches, go pick out some outfits. This is something I don't understand. Whenever I shop, the guy section is at the end of the mall. Um, so my girl, Adrienne, um, she's kind of hipster, like she's got her own thing going on. So I think I'm just gonna check out like Forever 21, H&M because they have a wide variety of stuff. I like black pants, black jeans actually because they're kind of casual, but at the same time, they're black enough that it kind of looks formal. Blue pants are hard to coordinate, but if you do coordinate it properly, can definitely do it. So I'm, I, might, I might probably pick this up. A nice little shirt that's buttoned up with polka dots on it. It's a little bit less plain than this one, so it kind of shows effort and shows style. I have a feeling she likes like these kind of prints. I don't 
know, I think this is cute, right? Something... I want her to wear something bluish, greenish. This is good. I think I have something going on. So, let's go. So we need definitely a splash color. And I think red is nice. Red is very romantic, right? I feel like shoes can tell a lot about a guy. I'm not too sure what kind of outfits like he likes though. Like I don't know what he's naturally used to wearing. So it's kind of hard for me to shop for him. So I'm going to just try to think of it as what I would get. All right, our coaches are back from the mall and we have our special guest judges. You'll remember them from last episode. Peter Adrian and so Joanna guys. Sotomura. Hi. Woo. 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 Yay. So Peter, Joanna, these yes. outfits are going to be first date outfits. What do you think would make a good first date outfit? Oh, well, I, I, we talked about this last time we were here together. Yeah, uh, yeah. Personally, for me, I prefer casual, nothing too crazy. You know, I mean, I feel like for a first date, you're kind of testing the waters. You don't mm. want to like scare someone off. I think anything that makes you feel like a formal version of yourself or like a more put together put together version of yourself, also something that, and we talked about this too, makes you mm. feel confident. So let's do Team Angie and Adrian first. Woo, okay. Right. Yeah. Okay. You guys ready to see my girl? Yeah. yeah. Okay, let's Exciting. bring out Adrian. Yeah. Woo! Yeah. Oh wow! So cute, right? Wow. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> so you want to tell us a little bit about your outfit? Oh yeah. So um, uh, she mentioned that she likes um like cute dresses and rompers. So I went with this blue, and she's nice. uh, she mentioned that she likes fun prints, and it's sort of like springy and like happy. So I went with this blue romper. Um, I chose this gold like accent necklace um, because she's pretty like low key, but I still want her to pop. As to her profile, it says, "I am a very upbeat girl who enjoys going on many adventures, like going to a concert, traveling to a foreign land, or trying new foods. When I'm not daydreaming or living life to the fullest, I eat French fries and drink cider all day long." All right, so you guys can leave for a second, and we're gonna judge your outfits and bio and everything. Okay, now behind closed doors, Peter and Joanna, what do we <laughs> yeah. think about the outfit and the um, bio? Personally, I'm not too big of a fan of the romper or the necklace. Mm -hmm. Just because I feel like it was, um, I don't know, I feel like the necklace really contradicted the way she looked and with the hair and everything, it mm -hmm. just kind of just didn't really sell it to me. It yeah. actually looked like she was trying too hard. Uh, I actually am a big fan of rompers because I think they're like a nice blend between casual and, and dressy. Um, but I do agree with Peter. I think the necklace was a little too uh, mismatched with the romper. Now for the bio, what do you mm. guys think? I love the bio. It was I super it was cute. Yeah. yeah. I, I, I would love to hang out with that person. I'm going to bring out my guy. Harry, come on out. Oh, Woo! Hello. Yeah. Looking sharp. Harry, how's it going? Hi. Nice to meet you. Very nice to meet you. So Harry's wearing some casual slash formal black boots. Uh, we got some black jeans. Uh, we got this kind of formal uh, dress shirt with uh, polka dots on it. And uh, to make it a little bit more casual, we added the jean jacket on top. Nice. Nice. Thanks. Oh, we got the watch too, <laughs> but that was his little add-on. You look great. Yeah. Thanks. Mm -hmm. So let's, uh, let's hear the bio. So, hi, I'm Harry Fan. Uh, I enjoy jogging, hiking, and cycling. But I like to waste my workouts eating pizza, french fries, <laughs> and drinking beer. <laughs> oh, nice. nice. Yeah, thanks. So you guys can take a step out and we are going to talk about your outfit. All right. Thank, Thank you. you guys. Nice. All right, Peter, Joanna, what do we think? I uh, liked it. I loved it. If they knew who, who I was in my style, yeah. they definitely went out for it. Mm -hmm. Like my thing is denim jackets like all the way. You put a denim jacket on anything and I'm like, I love it. <laughs> well, I like too that it was a denim jacket, but it didn't look like your typical denim jacket. It had that nice, I sort love of, like, the color. Yeah, oh my god, it was so nice. He looked like we talked about, like a polished version of the person that he presented. So he looked yeah. like a great, first date yeah. outfit. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to bring out my contestant, Sam. Ooh, Hello. 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 Looking good. Yeah, yeah, nice to meet you. So why don't you guys tell us a little bit about your outfit? So we talked about this before, and we were already on the same page with like a classy, but still like not too overdressed, a little casual, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so we picked out these, this outfit. So we started off with the cardigan, just because I think we uh, having like a little splash of color would be definitely nice, a little eye catching. Mm -hmm. And the very simple black button down uh, with blue pants and nice pair yeah, of black boots. Can't see it, but his boots are pretty fly. So for our bio, uh, I talked to June and we decided to come up with uh, a little thing that kind of incorporated poetry and whatnot. So <laughs> mm -hmm. here we go. Uh, try not to laugh, it's actually pretty cheesy, pretty cool. Me too. Okay. Jesus is my cheesy. favorite. Okay, so <laughs> the name Sam. And no, I don't like green eggs and ham. <laughs> but I do like brunch on the beach and red wine with sliced peach. <laughs> <laughs>
get to know me, it could be a treat. All right, guys, what do we think about Sam? And his outfit. Oh yes. Yeah, Besides that, <laughs> well, I think it's. I think you see a lot of black and navy coming back in that color combo, but it's really hard. Yes, that's to exactly what I was gonna say. Pair it's just, it well. Mm. It's yeah. I, I really it's like very the very strong <sighs> contrasting color to the cardigan. I thought was so charming and like it fit his personality, his hairstyle, his glasses. Like it was. It was a perfect bow, and I think. Maybe paired with different pants and yeah, shirt or like would softer have been... colors. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. something just a but little bit. Keep the cardigan more... for sure. It was super charming. And how about his bio? Oh, it was cute. I love <laughs> it. <laughs> it was fantastic. I, I listened and I was like, this is great. Um, I thought it was very cute and charming, but I, I would have also liked to have heard a little bit more of, of who he was. Mm. Welcome back, everyone. <laughs> and great work on all of your outfits, guys. Yeah. Seriously. Yeah. 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 Are you ready to find out who the winner is for this challenge? Yes. Yes. Drum roll, please. The winner is Harry and Jeffrey! Once again, this episode is brought to you by East Meet East, the premier dating site for Asian singles. If you want to find out more, click on the link in the description below. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys are learning something new about dating every time. And if you have any questions, make sure to leave your questions in the comment section below. And make sure to follow us all online and subscribe to ISA TV. See you guys next time. Woo! If you approach like a good looking Asian guy and they're kind of tall, chances are they're taken. So like just make sure like you can read them well. They look like they're not taken. I don't know. You can just tell, right?